Hello and welcome back to my channel. Hi guys, my name is Donna and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing this look for you guys. You already saw the thumbnail. Yes indeed, I am using Huda Beauty 3D Highlighting Palette. This is an all-in-one palette so hence the whole face being done. Um, if you guys want to know what I think about the product and how the product works, then please keep on watching. Right, we're gonna get straight into this video because you already saw what is done. And Huda Beauty, baby! So we are going to use this little number right here. Let's take her off her packaging. I don't know if you guys seen the video before where. Oh, God, I'm burping. I'm talking about Huda Beauty, and I thought it was just a highlighter thing, but no, it's more than that. It is also a. Look at her face. Look at this. Can you guys see this? Oh! Yes, so this is also a full face prep thing. So you got the um, prep side, which is number one over here, which is called Barbados. And then we have number two, it's called Set, which is called Maldives. So it's dab Maldives over your cheeks to temple to set and bring out the pop. So I take it, that's the highlighter. And then you have number three, which is Sculpt over here. And this one is apply Aruba under cheekbones to add definition and shape. So I'm talking about contour. The other one is Bora Bora, which is flash. Um, swipe Bora Bora on apples of your cheeks and a healthy glow. I don't know why I'm not focused. There I am. So prep is like apply uh, Barbara Barbados on a base and smooth skin and amplify light reflecting pearls. So let's start that. We're gonna use Bora Bora right here. Can you see? Yep. I did a little swatch there. I'm gonna use Bora Bora on my face so that's gonna be like my applicator. I've gotten so tan guys. Oh my god. So basically London has had this heat thing going on like this. It got sunny and I couldn't resist so I went up to the roof which I'm not supposed to I went up there and fell asleep and I end up tanning a lot I was in the beach I uh, I fell asleep in the beach <laughs> so let me like put this so that's what it looks like it's nice and smooth uh, I am going to use my fingers for this there's no mirror here just so you know and I'm just simply applying these I just want to say thank you so much to the um, Huda Beauty team for setting this up for me. So, Kirsty and your team, thank you guys so much. You guys are literally the best. <laughs> um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. <laughs> it's got no smell. Uh, the application is somewhat okay. It's sticky, that's for sure, which is a good sign. That means the foundation will stick. I like to put it under my eyes, so then like... Oh, someone's revving their car, I'm so sorry. I like to put the highlighter under my eyes so that this part will glow a lot more. Can you just imagine, I'm just gonna do this and then go to the grocery store to just get mangoes. Life of uh, 2020, guys. Get ready and go to the shop and get your mangoes. Okay, so the prep is already on. I am looking a little gold statuist. <laughs> That's what I feel like I'm looking right now. Um, so I am going to start putting the foundation on. And with the power of editing, my foundation will be on right now. Okay, so I just said foundation. I'm sorry. I meant to say full face. <laughs> so I did my full face. Um, yes. Now it's time to give this face some color. So now I'm going to do the sculpting, which is... Um, normally it says here, like, Maldives to do second, as in to do the highlight for the cheeks and stuff. But I always do my... I always do my contour first. Force. I always do my contour first and then blush and then highlight. So I'm gonna go in that order. So I will skip number two and I'll go straight to number three and four, which is um, Aruba and Bora Bora. 
So here we go. Uh, I'm gonna take my contour brush right here, Primark, <laughs> uh, and just use this like so. <sighs> um, tap the axis and just scooch. Interesting. And see this. Examine this, because it looks it looks nice on the camera. However, I want to see if it's like gonna give me a like shimmer, whatnot. But so far, it's giving me that nice bronze. So I'm gonna go again on the other one. You know what's giving this is giving me like holiday vibes. So if you want to do like that nice bronzy shimmer kind of goddess look, like this is what is giving me. I bet that's the whole point of this, right? Donna, like, duh. That's the whole reason she made this for holiday, probably. So it is not um, as highlighted as I thought it was going to be, so which is quite good, because I don't want to have a bronzy, like, chick with a whole highlight going on, you know what I mean? Uh, also, feedback about... If you can see my skin, I put the foundation on... I put the foundation on my skin, but at the same time, on camera it looks matte, but on re like real life, like I can see like a little shimmer going on and stuff, which is quite good. I like that. I like the whole dewiness. It made my foundation look dewy in real life rather than a super matte one. So I'm just doing my bronze where I always do. Um, I don't need much because it's already looking quite good. I'm quite happy with it. Let's do the nose. Oh, okay. I put a little too much on the nose. Freaking heck. Oh, just clean this up. Much better. God. Put the axis at the bottom of my neck. So how's everyone's life during this whole lockdown, guys? Like, have you picked up a new hobby? Have you have new series to watch? At the moment, I am watching um, Viking. I know I'm gonna late out the game, but my boyfriend really likes Viking, so I was like, okay, let me get... Speaking of my boyfriend, he texts me. <laughs> I still have a lot to go through with it which i'm really happy i'm so far i'm loving the show um i'm gonna take my blush brush and go for bora bora now just to just no feedback guys not a lot of fallout just so you know so it's quite good it's not like one of those um powders where like a lot comes off and anything like that. it's not like it's not that deep so i'm just putting this on my cheekbone it's a little um highlighty though so it's not too highlighted, it's just giving you some nice glowy color, which is quite good. I quite like it. I wonder how it will look if I put, start putting like a flash on, you know. Go in the sun! Woo! She's highlighted! Um, yeah, so as I was saying, um, Viking, really love it. This is probably where all the inspiration comes from. I just want to get like little hair cuffs so I can like put it in my hair and get that all nice and decorated. And also like when they have like these braids, they have these really nice curls. I only know this because I tested it on my boyfriend and I was like, oh my god, I need this in my life. I got jealous of my boyfriend because he had some nice curls so... I wanted to do them too. I was like, I need to look as cute as you so... <laughs> That's that's that was my plan. And um, yes, blush and contour is on. If you hear some noise in the background, guys, I am so sorry. I am doing laundry again. Every time I film, I do laundry. <laughs> what is wrong with me? <laughs> um, yeah, so let me get my um uh, where you at girl? My contour. Not contour. <laughs> my highlighted brush. Uh, something's going on with this camera. Why you keep flaking on me, dude? Like, you, you keep going all fuzzy on me and then you're focusing? Like, I don't understand. I, I literally don't understand. Does it look lately like I'm wearing a lot of black tea in my videos? I don't know. Every time I seem like I'm filming, I'm having a black tea on. But if that's not the case, then it's just all in my head and I've been dreaming about it that I've been filming. <laughs> 
<laughs> ah, I've been losing my mind. Literally losing my mind. Like, I always dream that I've done something and I have not. I wake up, I'm like, oh, did I just do that? Or did I only... Sometimes I have a conversation with my boyfriend, my dream, or my friends, or my sister. I'm like, oh, we didn't even have this conversation already? No, Donna, it never happened. Yeah. Anyways, moving on. I'm gonna go to number two now, which is the highlighted one, and it's called Maldives. Uh, I'm taking Maldives. Viking is the show I am watching at the moment. Uh, what? Ooh. Okay, now there's a difference. You can see that. So, um, talking about. Sorry, I was talking about. I always do this. I talk about a series, and then I, I look at myself on my like off topic again. Um, I'll go back to the topic again, like to my previous topic. Well, as I was saying, the bronzer and the, um, oh, let me just say it this way. The bronzer, which is um, Aruba and Bora Bora, the blusher, they're not as, then like, I'll come closer and you can see like, they don't have any like that much shimmer on them. It's just like a very like tinted one. Not like this highlighter though, because the highlighter has like, you can see it's glowing, you know what I mean? Like, look at this. Pow. Damn. And just a little bit, too. So, as I was saying, Viking is the show I'm watching at the moment, and I am truly loving it. I'm getting so into, like, the characters and stuff like that. Uh, and, oh, God. At one point, the char one of the main characters cheated on his wife. I got so offended because I really love his wife. And, like, oh, I was just like, you have to kill her! <laughs> Like, cause she's a vo warrior as well. It kind of reminds me of like the whole Xenat princess kind of thing, which I was a huge fan when I was a kid. But yeah, you think you would have already known yourself, right? But when you self-isolate, you just realize it when you're sitting there on your own sometimes, thinking, God, it's the worst. Uh, TikTok is off the charts, guys. Everyone knows like now TikTok has been off the roof everyone's going ballistic over it every time i'm like bored or something i just go to tiktok just to see funny videos so that is that uh, and yeah i was thinking to do like a whole like get ready with me q a video what do you guys think um let me know down in the comments below if you want that to happen i am more than happy to share that with you i can do the q a thing on instagram and then follow it by on this video. Um, sorry, my phone's dinging. <laughs> I'm sorry, my boyfriend's like, <laughs> send me videos of my bike. <laughs> I left in his garage, by the way. Oh, <laughs> uh, what am I missing? I'm missing lips, guys. Hold on, I got. You see, you, you, you keep blurring out on me every day. I keep, why do I have to fight with you, camera? Huda Beauty Lipstick, and this is called Girlfriend Liquid Matte Lipstick. So I'm gonna do a little more. Uh, I'm gonna add this on the lip. Nice matte lipstick. Mmm, smells like, I don't know, it smells like some kind of food. Yeah. Okay, so that is the lipstick. I've kept it almost all in the brand. Unfortunately, I have not done the foundation, the eyes or the lashes or anything like that of Huda Beauty. That's why I had to do everything off camera, so I hope you don't mind. Uh, but the rest, which is this palette alone, is all Huda. Uh, and the lipsticks itself. Why is it on my cheeks? I want to put Nil Glitzy, so I'm going to add the prep, which is very soft, by the way. I hope I mentioned that. I'm going to add that on here. Oh, yeah. I want her glowing. Forgot to mention. You see this little card thing that they gave me inside with Huda's? Yeah, oh, actually, you know, this is a prime example, actually. So you see, like, how 
Okay, there you go. You see how she's like shimmering here, 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 here. I think that's all to do with the palette itself. Like they're just giving you the little highlight spots. Spots. I can't speak today. What's going on with me? Like, so these are the little highlight spots going on. Um, and yeah, that is what it is. Let me set my face and I'll give you the whole thoughts, a review after this break. <laughs> okay, so everything is nice and set. Let us talk about this. <laughs> so, um, first off, I think it's a wonderful piece of having like a whole face thing because I am truly shocked about how good this is. Do you see this? Like, I am glowing and it also gives me the whole prep Thing, like you know like the primer before foundation gave me the whole like glow within kind of thing uh, and I really like that and it's even doing it now with my lips after putting that lipstick the matte lipstick and I like the whole dewiness look uh, while putting foundation on top it worked really really well so hopefully like you know it's not cracking whatsoever it's not flaking as a primer it looks fine um, I really like the bronzing thing as well, so that will be used very often now on my cheeks. Uh, so will my blusher and the highlight. So that's definitely gonna be the whole the whole thing will be used over and over again. So I just want to say thank you again to Huda Beauty and your team for sending that over to me. I truly, truly enjoy making this look and. Um, creating this whole thing together and stuff like that so thank you again so much i am rambling on when i get nervous so yeah um oh the lockdown is almost done guys so we are out to be free um i've been going out with my bike so i haven't been really like abiding by the rules i have been abiding by the rules by not meeting a lot of people though i mean people in the same group that's what i've been doing rather than like it's just me and my boyfriend like we're always getting on our bikes and just riding off somewhere you know we've been going off to like the beach just to ride take the like bikes out and ride out there and stuff like that so that's what we've been doing um other than that <laughs> The roads are getting busier here. I kind of miss when it was not busy, so like I could go on my motorcycle and just like ride around. It feels it feels fine, but now like going to my boyfriend's garage because he works in the, um he owns his own garage and going over to his garage normally is like a smooth ride, no cars whatsoever. But now the roads are getting busier. I'm like, oh, I'm not used to having so much cars around me. So yeah that is what it is uh but the new norm is happening so yeah guys i hope everyone is keeping safe being happy um loving life to the fullest i know these are difficult times during jobs as well so my prayers out out there for you guys so i hope everything goes well um yes i'm gonna stop rambling this is gonna be a very quick video for you so <laughs> yeah um I just want to say thank you so much for tuning in guys. Thank you for those who are new to my channel Welcome, thank you for coming in and enjoying this video If you do enjoy this video, please go on down below and click the subscribe button and the thumbs up button So I know that you guys like it. It makes me really really happy to know You know when you guys are watching and stuff like that your comments are being seen and heard So I am very very grateful and really happy So I do try my best to comment every one of you guys as well so yes, thank you again to Huda Beauty for sending this over and I want to say thank you to my true subscribers out there, the ones, the fam jams that's always been around. Thank you so much for your love and support. I tr I, uh, I don't know, I'm truly grateful for everything that you've done. We are now a 1k followers and you know, I'm so happy, I'm so grateful. So thank you so much guys for doing all of that and yeah, you truly make me a happy person. So I'm gonna log off now before I get all mushy and stuff. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye!